So I play volleyball for Miss Lewis, and one thing I like about her is she's very understanding. Um, she's very open to our opinions. It's very easy to go and talk to her about like certain issues we're having. She often like will ask us like what we want to do in practice, if like there's any certain drills or things that we want to work on personally, and I think that's important um, as a coach to like like specify like different things to each member because obviously each member isn't going to be on the same skill level um and she's very inclusive she'll have different activities for like the freshman jv and varsity together because she wants us to all get along obviously and it's important to her that like when varsity's playing that jv is there to support or when jv's playing or freshman uh, varsity will go support so i think that's a big th uh, part of being a good coach is like wanting every team member to feel like they're included so i think she does that well tremendous impact on the program this first year. Led us to a 14 and 5 overall record while also winning a league championship. Led us to a section semifinal and a county's quarterfinal. And that's something they can show with uh, Coach impact on the program. So on behalf of the whole program, thank you Coach Coe and Halfway National. <laughs> Hi, I'm Chris Aleppa and I run indoor track, outdoor track and cross country. And my coach is John Murta. Now over the last few years I've grown as a runner and a person, and I can really thank Mert for all of that. He taught me to be more dedicated, a uh, better athlete, and also just a better person who could listen more and learn how to really handle like taking in others' advices and not always having to be so independent. Learning that I could be a leader and all sorts of things. I think a really big thing is uh, a good coach can lead a good team if he has good talent. And you don't always get that, but a good coach can do that stuff. A great coach can impact the lives of the people they have on their team. And I really feel like Mert has impacted my life and made me a better person. So I think that really shows how good of a coach he is, at least to me. And I'm sure plenty of other runners have said very similar things too. The amount of guys who have come out and said, yeah, there's just some good years. And the fact that it just shows in the program how even if we don't always have some world beaters on our team, we still have some good guys. And all the guys on the team grow up over the years and become better guys over time. Not just as runners, but as people too. Like, I've become a better person. I know other people who have too. And I really have to thank Murph for that because he taught me when to hold myself back and when to really put myself in the pain I needed to be. He taught me to be more dedicated. He taught me to make myself some goals and go after them. And all of these things make you a better person too. He taught me to listen better and to respect what others have to say because even though you might have the best intentions, other people still have been in similar places and they know where you're coming from. So just so many things that have made me better and I have to thank him for all of those things because I wouldn't be the person I am without him today. So thanks for your On behalf of the girls soccer team, we'd like to say thank you to all our coaches, Coach Lombardo, Del Santo, and Corsonini. They taught us that effort comes a much longer way than skill, and that you should always give your 110% throughout practices and games. They continue to push us every day, and we love them. Hi, I'm Ava Quinn from the girls tennis team, and on behalf of the team and I, we'd like to thank Coach Gallione for all he does for us. He really mo helps motivate us during our matches and gives the best advice. Thanks. So for National Coaches Day, I think that it is important for the players of all the different sports to show appreciation for our coaches and what they've done for us over the years. As a football player especially, I know that our coaches have taught us lessons that transcend the game of football and that will help us later on in our lives. For example, they preach things such as effort, commitment, dedication, teamwork, and doing your job. And I think that all of these, these lessons have not only developed us on the field as football players, but have also helped to shape us into better people off the field. I think it is also important to thank our coaches for all the time and effort that they've put in over the years. 
they take time that they could have been spending with their families or doing other things to help develop us on the field and to help make game plans so that we can go out there and execute and win games. And I think that we should all just be appreciative for all the effort that they put in, both in the season and the off season. And I know that specifically with football, our coaches just put in the most amount of time possible. It's definitely a 365 day sport, so we just couldn't be more thankful.